it's, it's not the typical convention atmosphere. It's like a family reunion. And you get to know and love all these people. And it's, it, it's the one con that I really look forward to each year. And so if you've never been to another convention, you know, don't try to compare it because this is unique and it's something special. And I really hope you enjoy the weekend.
the cookies that Jay was talking about is actually sort of like synthetic kettlebells. <coughs> yeah, it's like it's like a little cookie. It's about that big, and it's like that fat. And they just throw it in like a tin dish, and they set fire to it, <laughs> and then let it burn for a couple of seconds, and then blow it out. And the smoke, it, it's a smoke bomb, literally, is what it is. And then they just kind of fan it. That was Larry Fiorito. Larry Fiorito, he liked that. And it just hangs in the air for half an hour. So, you know, and you're going, <laughs> Why, this is good for you. <laughs> the other one, what, it's like this giant sort of 50 gallon drum of vegetable oil. And you heat this vegetable oil up, and then there's like, it's like vegetable oil and dry ice, and forced air, and a big fan. Yeah. So that and that stays up in the air for a long time. Right. You know. And at, and at the end of the day, if you shake your fingers and go like that, it's like all over your skin. Yeah. Oh, that's right. So we got that all going on. Yeah. And then eight or nine of us are walking around with like, you know, hey, no! Solve the problems. Let me talk to you for a second. It was like, you know, the Uncle Louie uh, Goldberg convention. Everybody's smoking big fat, mouthy cigars, and and all you hear. Of course, Margaret's not going to say word one because you know she's too nice. But you know, Linda walks in and says like, "Ah, uh -uh. this ain't happening when I'm here." You know, like, what? What's going on? You know, hey, how you doing, kid? You know, it's the special effects guy. Good talk to him. It's Gary. Uh, it's Gary Bentley. That's what it is. He's using something different over there. Yeah. What's it? So that lasted for a couple of weeks. The bananas and skin milk and. Grapefruit juice and vinegar. Cigars. We take a break and then I come back to the trailer and maybe I'd go out to the craft service. Cry. It's like you know seven in the morning or whatever, and Ron's sitting in there. And then I come in and it's like, are you in there? Then <laughs> 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 there's all these sort of spontaneous, adventurous moments where it's like, go out and get this CD. But I'd go run out, just run like that's a big carpet. And then that's all that was on the CD player on show for like, what, when you guys show for like two weeks. Like, how many times in two weeks can you listen to Don't Worry, Be Happy? I'm worried, I'm not happy. Remember that one? was like, well, I've had for a while, Don't Worry, Be Happy. Mark's like, okay, am I going to say one more time? I'm going to glue your mouth shut. Yeah. You know that hair on your fingernails? It won't come out. Painted and prepped and 
So Margaret would then sit in the trailer when the two Ludniks would leave and work for two hours alone, painting and prepping five, ten of the masks in a row, or, or if, you know, time warranted, only 